So this is a really cool little plushie that I saw the other day. And so I decided to grab one just because it was really adorable. And this is by an artist. And they did a thing with the Pokemon Center to come out with these, this whole set. There's, and they've been a few different like ways, I guess, of the plush. But the Soda Refresh, the Psycho uh, Soda Refresh is what they're, they're titled under. And this is from one of the newer, or newish sets that they did. And this one had Togepi. And from what I've seen, they've done like four of them at a time. But uh, this artist has done a lot of different other artists, like non um, collaborations, I guess you want to say. But this is, you know, one of the newer ones. And one of the really cool ones that they've done, because they've done some Pokemon ones. And they're, they're just really adorable and really cool. And, and for sure, art style is super unique too. I know Togepi is a bit more simple over a Pokemon, but really cool Pokemon. Really cute Pokemon overall. Of course, Misty's carrying around uh, all day, of course. But yeah, so you can see by the... And that's kind of what's the, the trademark for this uh, artist, for sure. is like the eyes done in this old school, like, tune style. Which is really cool and, like, really, like, nostalgic looking to it, of course. And so these... It's nice because these eyes are embroidered with its little mouth embroidered as well. And normally it would be like in black, but it's in this really nice, like darkish. I don't know, it's lighter. Oh no, it's dark. It's like a darkish blue. And then of course, with it being like this, this shinier uh, threading on that or whatever, it just gives it a really nice shine. I really like how that is. And then Togepi just has the little bottom of its feet with some more of that pink to give it one little toe bean, which is cool. Um, or it could be like an upside down nail or something. It'd be funny. And then, of course, it just has the printing, which, I don't know, I think that's kind of lazy. Just to have the printing of its eggshell like that, kind of lazy. Um, and that's kind of it, you know. And then it just has its little, its little like, crown little top or whatever. And that's kind of it, really. The tush tag is a special tush tag. Yeah. Psycho Soda Refresh. And these are kind of hard to get sometimes, especially after they sell out. Sell out. And unfortunately, yes, these are Japan only. Um, so I know it says Pokemon Center on there, but that's Pokemon Center Japan, not the American one. So these are kind of annoying to get because you have to get them from the Pokemon Center or something or like get them secondhand or something like that. But I uh, know I got this for a friend. And so I just thought it was a really cute little Togepi. And uh, I hope my friend likes it. And for sure, it's 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 a set that's really, really cool. There's a lot of really neat cute very simple but very pleasing very pleasing plushies in that lineup but i do got to warn you guys too if you're trying to get some of the the plushies from this line there are a lot of fake ones and this plushie line that the pokemon center has done uh it's it's gotten really expensive for the older ones for sure so you got to be careful if you do want an authentic one because i mean it's it's bad cuz i've seen I've seen some of these little guys at the flea market, you know, and they're charging like 20 bucks for each one, which doesn't sound like a bad deal, but they're all fake ones. So it's like, why would I pay $20 from the flea market when I could order myself off Wish for like 3 or $5? You know, I don't really support, um, I really don't support bootleg buying and stuff like that at all. That's why I don't do it. But um, it's like one of those things, like, why would I do that when I could do this or something? It just never made any sense to me, but... Just letting you guys know, if you want an authentic one, uh, you just got to try to make sure to keep out, keep an eye out for it. And then, of course, make sure it has the huge, this huge freaking tag. All of them have this huge freaking tag. Yeah, you can see right there, Pokemon Center, you know, all that stuff. But yeah, so that's just a thing to keep in mind. So that way, you know, you don't end up with a fake one. And like they're trying to charge you like 50 60 $100 for a... You, for them claiming it's a real one when it's obviously a fake one or whatever but uh yeah really cute cool line really good artist so i i do follow this artist on twitter and there's a lot of really neat art stuff that that they do and i just think it's really really cool and of course i mean if you're doing art and you're doing art with pokemon like officially like that's a that's a pretty big it's a pretty big accomplishment that's really freaking cool you know so yeah, so I know this is a really simple plushie on this one, but really cute and adorable. And uh, yeah, so that's all I got for this one. So thanks for watching.